All right, Shalom, Shalom, Akim. All right, first I'd like to give all praises and honor and glory unto the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son, Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Rokakadash. Double honors to my apostles, the elders, a great millstone who grew well and taught me this truth. And Shalom to all the brothers out there to the four corners of the earth, pushing this word in all righteousness and sincerity, Shalom. All right, the true names of the Heavenly Father is Yahweh. All right, and the true name of the, of the only begotten Son is Yahweh Shai, all right, who the world any calls Jesus Christ. All right, and this lesson, the Spirit of Yahweh is going to be named the love of money equals taking the RFID chip. Okay, all right, and as we all know, you know, um, as you should know, the RFID chip is the mark of the beast according to the scriptures. Okay, you know, all right, and we're gonna we're gonna prove that again. You know, for brothers that might be coming new onto um this video, just finding out the so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. Are the, according to the seed of your father that you are the Israelites, okay? You know, you coming in that there's a commandment for us not to take the RFID chip, which is the mark of the beast, okay? And there's a consequence for that, man. But, you know, this world, and they push the love of money, the love of materialism, okay? All right, all that coincides with the mark of the beast, man, because as the scriptures say, you know, you're not going to be able to buy or sell, you know? Do any financial transactions, you know? So if you're in the spirit of, uh, I love money, that uh um that uh Floyd Money Mayweather spirit, oh I love money, I love money. Then when this RFID chip is presented to to the masses, all right, you're gonna take it and you're gonna fold under the um under the pressure of loving money, okay? You know, under the under the uh, pressure of you not being able to make any financial transactions, okay? So the first uh, scripture I actually want to get is uh First Timothy chapter. Six. Is of all evil kind, the love of money. There's a difference. People say in the world that money is the root of is the root of all evil. It's not money, all right? Because you can do plenty of uh, righteous things with money. Pay tithes, you know, you know, do do things according that you're supposed to with money. All right, as scriptures say, money is the of defense. So it's not the money that is the root of all evil. All right, what is it? It says. For the love of money, kind, for the love of money, man, all right, people sell out for money, all right, for the love of the money, man, all right, for the love of uh, materialism, all right, you know, have having um, uh, materialistic things, man, all right, the, this, the love of money is the root of all evil, man, you have people selling out for money, all right, people doing all types of things, wicked things for money, man, okay, so it's the love of money, all right, all right, which is going to equal into people taking the RFID chip. Because why? This is uh, First uh, Timothy chapter uh, 6, verse 10. It says, For the love of money is the root of all evil, which while some covet after it, kind of people covet after it, and they crave, they 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 lust after the, you know, money, you know, oh, I got to get this bag, or I got to get this bag, you know? That's the mind frame Jake is in, man, right now. Okay? All right, you so-called new Latinos and Native Americans. That's the mind frame that our people are in right now. Okay, it says, it says they have erred from the faith kind. You even have people who erred from the faith because of money. All right, you know, great examples that we have. Hey, IYC, all right, <laughs> you know, Nate, all right, uh, Yahana, all of them have the uh, uh, 501c3 charges, which means they're tap, ta uh, tax exempt, man. All right, they don't pay taxes, they're earning a lot of money. All right, you know, uh, um. Uh, making shirts, making people pay for shirts, pay for garments, all these things, man. You know, uh, same thing with Sakari and all of them, man. All right, the love of money that made them err from the faith. Okay, all right, the love of money made them um not seek after how about Shimao Shine no more, man. Seek after uh, a dollar, okay? you know, <clears throat> erred from the faith and pierced themselves through. With many sorrows, kind, because people go out of their way to get money, man, all right? They go out of the way, they do things that they would never normally do, all right? All right, you know, you know, they uh, basically give up their integrity for money, okay? All right, which integrity is a very important thing of having the truth, but that's for another lesson, man, okay? It's the love of money that's what's gonna, is connected to the RFID chip, man, all right? You know, the buying and purchasing and selling, the love of money, the love of materialism is what's going to make you uh, uh, take that RFID chip, all right? And um, the spirit, I didn't have this plan, but I'm going to look up the word uh, 
uh, materialism, okay? Let's see. Materialism. Material. Come materialism. There we go. Boom. That fast is materialism is a tendency to material possessions or physical and physical comfort as more important than spiritual values time hey, hey that's the spirit man okay all right that's that's the that's a heavy definition man okay so now going back to love of money all right which is really materialism is what's going to cause these people to take the rfid chip i'll read that definition again it says uh materialism it says a tendency to consider material possessions money money's a materials substance okay it says and physical comfort all right, because money can comfort people in a certain way. Okay, it says as more important than spiritual values. All right, <laughs> and what's the spirit, man? These scriptures, man. All right, the true spiritual values is these scriptures, man. And which one of the, one of the things that the Lord told us not to do is take the mark of the beast, man. All right? All right? There's a consequence if you do, which we're gonna get into. Man. All right, All right. Let's see. go to verse thirteen. All right, and you're gonna see. What what I mean uh, by you know that is it, materialism, the love of money ties in with taking the RFID chip, man. Okay, but just off these scriptures alone, okay. And it reads, um, Slaki, let me get it. It's Revelations chapter thirteen, verse sixteen. Okay, there we go. And it reads, it says, <clears throat> he calls of all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive a mark in their right hand or in their foreheads. Kind, okay? To receive a mark in the right hands or their foreheads. All right? And we, we go into the, re, uh, the word, um, okay. It means to constitute, man. All right. Let me go down to the list, list, list of definitions. All right. So Esau Edom, all right, which is the he that is talking about, all right, is going to cause constitute, which means make law. All right. Make mandatory. All right. You know, uh, all both small and great. All right. The, the, the little to the, to the old. All right. It says both rich and poor. All right. Those have a, have a lot of money. Floyd mother, Floyd money, Mayweather type men. All right. To the average bum on the street. All right. It says rich and poor, free and bond. All right, you have your people who walk freely out here, you know, doing what they want to do, and then people up in jail, man. Okay, it says to receive a mark. All right, and when you go into that word mark in the Greek, it's kragma. All right, which means an incision under the skin, or, or, or um, you know, a, a prick or incision under the skin, basically, which claims you as property. All right, so when you take this mark or the RFID chip, all right, because the RFID chip is the only thing that's gonna be the people's skin and we see it right now in the masses of the, the media okay all right it says um it says the mark to receive a mark all right so that that's the rfid chip man all right say so it says in the right hand or the foreheads verse 17 that no man might buy or sell save he that have the mark. save he that had the mark or the name of the beast or the number of his name, kind, okay? So you won't be able to buy or sell, do any financial transactions whatsoever, all right? All right, your your regular paper dollars won't be nothing. It'll be the RFID chip that holds your uh, electronic credits on there, you know, basically. Same thing as the debit card, how basically it's electronic numbers and stuff on your bank. On your bank. The same thing with the RFID, the RFID chip is gonna be a new credit card, man, okay? You know? <clears throat> And we ought not to take because the scriptures tell us not to, okay? And there's a judgment, you know, a, 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 a judgment for taking that, man, okay? You know, you know, a, a consequence. But as you can see, the love of money, materialism, which is, I'm going to read that, <laughs> I'm read that description again, all right? I'm, actually, I'm going I'm to read both of them. Here's the materialism, a noun, okay? Um, from, it reads, 
to consider material possessions or physical comfort as more important than spiritual values. Kind, you you look at money and more uh, important than being spiritual. All right, basically being carnal, carnally minded, and we know that carnal minds are at enmity with the Most High. All right, which means you know your enemy to your Halba Shema Shai. If you um, if you uh, what's it called um. If you're carnal minded, man, and if you love money, have the love of money, you're carnal minded, man. All right, because you look, um, love of money equals materialism, which means you don't look at the things of the spirit, okay? You look at the things that can physically comfort you, man, okay? You know, and that's what this world promotes money, 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 materialism, 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 mainly on our people, you so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, okay? But like you said, as you see, you won't be able to buy and sell, okay? Read the scripture again. This is, um, Revelation chapter 13, verse 16. And that no man or sell, if he that had the mark, kind. All right. So you won't make, you won't be able to make no financial transactions, man. All right. So if you really love money, all right, you, which they like said, the love of money is the root of all evil. And this is the evil thing if you take it, okay, you know, that you go to, it's the root of it, man. All right. The love of money is the root of it. So you loving money like you do. Being in that Floyd Money Mayweather spirit is going to make you take the RFID chip, man. All right. Now, you, you being a material, uh, into materialism, materialistic, all right, is going to make you take the RFID chip because you feel that physical comforts, all right, you buying, you selling, you getting things, you getting a new car, you getting a new house, all right, you feel that as more uh, comfort, you regard that more than values, which these scriptures, man, all right, knowing the true doc doctrine of Yahweh by Shimei on Shai, which most of our people are going to take this RFID chip, okay, all right, um, next scripture I want to get is, uh, Revelations, uh, 14, because uh, this is the consequence for that, man, all right, and we're like, so I'm going to get straight to the points with this, like, showing you, if you love money, all right, you're going to take the RFID chip, because you want to buy and sell, all right, and we're going to show you the consequence for doing that, man, all right, so, you know, just plain and simple, here's not what not to do, and if you do it, you know, this is the consequence, man. Okay. So uh scripture on uh next scripture is Revelation fourteen and um nine and it reads And the third angel followed them saying with a loud voice, If any man worship the beast and his image receive his mark or in so showing you it doesn't matter where you get it. You know, <laughs> the apostles elders you know make fun of it, but it's still true. It don't matter if you get in your left butt cheek, man. All right, if you get the mark with inside you, all right, you have committed a, a grave, grave sin that is unrepentable, man. Okay, you can't repent from that. Okay, it says, uh, receive his mark in his forehead or in his hand. The same shall drink the wine of the wrath of Yahweh Bashim Shai. Kind. All right, you got to drink the wine of the wrath of the Heavenly Father, man. All right, <laughs> which is uh, no joke, man. All right, which we're going to get the word wrath really fast, you know, the word wrath and see what that word means. Okay. Wrath. This is wrath from Google. It says extreme anger chiefly used for. Uh. Yeah, it says extreme anger, anger, rage, outrage, uh, displeasure. Okay, um, let's see. Kind. It says a it says uh, strong, vengeful anger, or indignation, which means righteous anger. Okay, it says divine chast chastisement. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Divine chastisement, man. All right, you got to get divinely chastised, man. All right, if you take this RFID chip, it says, it says, it says the same shall drink the, the wine of the wrath, all right, divine chastisement, all right, of, of Yahweh Bashim al Shai, which is poured out without mixture. So it's going to be not diluted, it's going to be straight, concentrated, you know, ass whooping. You know, the back of the back of the work, you know. You know, is yeah, how about Shima Shah is gonna give it to you? And how else he gonna give it to you? Through them thermonuclear missiles, man. You know? <laughs> Which, you know, hey, brother's been having dreams all over the place, man, and hey man, one of those things that you don't wanna experience is thermonuclear fire, man. All right. You know? You know, that it's something serious, man. You know? Uh you know, burning at millions and millions of degrees, man. To like scripture.
eyes consuming their holes, man. Your tongue consuming your mouth, man. All right. You being melted with fervent heat, man. Okay. You don't want to experience that. But if you take this RFID chip, you will. Okay. You will experience that. All right. If you have the love of money, which will cause you to take the RFID chip, if you're materialistic, which will cause you to take the RFID chip, you will be burnt with um, um fire. Okay. With them ICBM nuclear missiles, man. All right. Because you don't take up the spiritual values of your how about you, Mal Shai. Okay. All right. It says. And without mixture into the cup of his indignation, righteous anger. Okay, it says, and shall be tormented with fire and brimstone in the presence of the holy angels and in the presence of the Lamb. Kind. All right, you're gonna be burnt up with them thermonuclear missiles because that's the modern day fire and brimstone. Okay, you know that's what you're gonna be burnt up in. And you get, and guess who's gonna be watching you get burnt up? The holy angels and Yahweh Shai, okay? Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, okay? And the elect too, all right? Because angels just be messengers. And hey, the men out here, we're the messengers too, all right? So, and the elect, <laughs> uh, you know, the 144,000, one third, you know, starting off with 144,000 as the main messengers, okay, of this truth. Hey, man, they'll be watching you burn, man. You know, Lord's will be a part of that number of the elect that we don't have to get burned, man, and that we don't take this RFID chip, all right? You know, that we would stay not materialistic, man. Okay. Hold on of your how you shy. So um I hope this letter lesson was edifying to you, Akium. You know, just showing you the love of money. And to anybody who come across this video, if you take this RFID chip and you're materialistic, you know, you're gonna be destroyed. So if you find yourself being materialistic, hey man, we gotta <laughs> cut back from that, man, and be more spiritual, man. All right. Because the carnal mind is an enemy to you. How about Shimei Al Shai? So, with that, I uh, had to give all praises and glory to the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son, Yahweh, Bashim, Yahweh Shai, Bashim, double honest to my apostles and others, a great millstone who rule well and taught me this truth. And shalom to all the brothers out there through the four corners of the earth pushing this word and all righteousness and sincerity. Shalom.